Hi, I'm Jim, the Quick Fix Tips Guy. Today we're going to talk about how to fix a trumpet valve. Oftentimes when you're teaching beginner trumpet players, they turn the valve counterclockwise, which unscrews it, and then this happens. So they'll come up to you and say, whoa, I have a broken valve. So this is how you fix this. First thing you do is you unscrew it, and it comes off like that in your hand. You wanna make sure that they, that they didn't do that and lose the spring. So you wanna make sure you look for the spring. Then tip it over and if it's well oiled, it'll pop right out. Oftentimes it's not oiled very well and that's actually why they're trying to take it off. So you have to unscrew the bottom cap here and push it through with your finger. So we've got this all together. So let's talk about the parts of the valve. This is what I call the Swiss cheese part because it looks like Swiss cheese. And then we have the valve guide. Sometimes the kids will come to you and it's all in pieces. So what you wanna do is you wanna take the valve and you find out, usually with trumpets, the number faces the mouthpiece. There's the number. So you wanna make sure that the valve guide, the seat goes here, goes in the hole all the way through till it comes out the other side. And then you turn it and it sits right down. Right here is a little place for the spring to set in. It's upside down if you don't have that little seat for the spring. So you make sure that side is up. I'll put it through again. Pivot it inside until it comes down like that. All right, and then put the spring in, and then you put this on, screw it down. <clears throat> Clockwise is tight, righty tighty. And then this is the stem, this is the valve stem right here. Here is the button. Oftentimes that comes off too. So, and they lose them. So what I always taught my beginners was righty tighty, always turn your valves to the right, no matter what. Never turn them to the left because you'll loosen things up and they'll fall apart. Then you get some oil. <clears throat> Put it back in the valve casing. I teach the kids, turn it till it clicks and can't turn anymore. Again, turning to the right or clockwise. All right. And then put it down. All right. And you can test it. And if you put it in wrong, you won't get air through there. Also, another way to check is make sure that the valve number, the number one, because this is the first valve, is facing the lead pipe or the mouthpiece in this case. And there you have it. So the first thing that to for preventive medicine is just teach the kids, when you take your valves out, always turn them clockwise. The only thing that goes counterclockwise, of course, is the valve casing cap. That goes counterclockwise to loosen it, and then you pull it out that way. So that's how the trumpet valve is constructed, at least on this type of trumpet, which is a Bach soloist. And, uh, and that's how you fix it if a kid comes to you and it's all loosey-goosey here. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos, head to my channel and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the bell button to be notified when another video comes out.